Hello, it's Friday, November 4th, 2016, which means that NaNoWriMo is truly underway. Um, I hope everyone participating is making good progress so far. If you aren't at the word count that you were hoping for, don't be disheartened. There is still a lot of time left to write, and I'm sure you can make it. My personal goals for the month, I don't think I've said yet, are to write every day and write at least 3,000 words. Um, I realize that's only like 60% or something of the suggested word count, but you know, that's just kind of the goal that made sense and seemed manageable to me. This is my 10th NaNoWriMo program. Wow, okay, that's a lot. <laughs> um, but this is my 10th NaNoWriMo program and I learned a while ago that the key to success for me is setting a goal that I actually feel I can reach, which is what I'm trying to do here. Um, writing, however, is going very well. It feels really, really great to be back. Um, I've worked on a couple of short stories here and there and, you know, like essays and stuff for school, but I haven't worked on my novel since like early September, I think, which is a very long amount of time to spend away from it. And I've definitely missed it as I've expressed in some past videos. So right now, before I have to deal with finals and all of that, you know, fun stuff, I am going to enjoy this month and enjoy getting to do as much writing as I can and, you know, just enjoy the time I have. Um, you know, it's shaping up to be a really great month looking at the calendar of events that NaNo is hosting, that my region is hosting. Um, it's going to be a really fun time and I I'm definitely looking forward to how it's going to play out. Um, hopefully, I really, really hope I'll be able to go to an actual physical local write-in at some point during the month, at least one. Um, fingers crossed on that. I'm not making any promises quite yet, but I really hope I'll find a way to figure it out. And, you know, now that I have a car and they're planning a lot more events, hopefully it will work out. Um, in non-writing related news, the 10th annual Project for Awesome is happening from December 9th to December 11th. Um, if you haven't heard about the Project for Awesome before, it was started in 2007 by John and Hank Green. And basically what happens is people make videos about charities that they care about and participants get to vote on which, you know, videos slash charities they like. And then at the end of the event, the charities with the most votes get big grants. Uh, last year, we raised like one, a little over $1.5 million. And the top charities got $25,000 grants. So it really is a big deal. And it really is a big project that accomplishes a lot of good for the world. Um, you can get involved by making a video donating money and or voting for charities that you want to see get grants. Um, you can vote for as many videos as you want. There's no limit. Uh, if there's a lot of videos for the same charity, you can vote for all of them. So it really is up to you where the money goes. So I really, really hope you'll get involved. That covers the basics of the event, but obviously there's a lot of detail I didn't go into just now. So I'm going to include some links in the video description to places where you can find more info and have your questions answered and, you know, learn all about the history and what's going on and figure out how everything works. And I'll also probably talk about it in the next vlog or two a little bit more as it gets closer. All right, that's it for me this week. Um, I hope you're liking this more planned out type of vlogging. Uh, I think I'm enjoying it so far. I'm not really positive quite yet. Um, it's taking some adjusting on my end, um, but I think things will get better once I get more experience and I'm a lot more natural with it, which I'm still having some issues figuring out different things, but I think it's going well. So I hope you're enjoying it as well. Um, as always, I encourage you to contact me with comments, questions, concerns, suggestions, anything. Um, I'm very easy to reach. You can comment here, uh, tweet me. My Facebook page has, you know, you can message that. Um, my website has a contact me 
section, so I'm very easy to get in touch with. So I really hope you'll reach out and contact me in any of those many ways. And that's about it. I hope everyone is doing well, and I will see you all in two weeks. Bye, guys.